Hey, my Legion. How y'all doing today? I'm back at Golden Corral with my buddy John. Having a salad, starting out his food overload at Golden Corral, trying out the rolls with butter. And they were absolutely fantastic. They were the yeast rolls with like that, uh, Land Lakes butter spread on them. I got a nice salad there with like, uh, the seafood salad on the side. And there's tomatoes on there, and you got, uh, bacon on there, and, uh, Eggs. Well, I had to try the seafood salad. See if it's any good. Yeah, I thought it was pretty decent. I mean, you know. I ho I was hoping they had broccoli salad there, but the seafood salad maybe like a 9 out of 10. Now let's try like some of the salad I made. Most of the veggies on top. I didn't I got a little bit of spinach on the bottom. I got cucumbers with the bacon and the eggs and stuff like that on there. Tomato, you have to have cherry tomatoes. I love tomatoes. So it's always mystifying me that food reviews don't like them. Okay, uh, that was really good. You got some spinach there. It was a decent salad. It wasn't a huge salad, but it was a decent salad. And I liked it a lot. Get some more stuff on there. Yeah, that was a 10 out of 10. Now, I'm coming back with some more meat items. You know, we got some pepperoni on there, too. Got to have that on the salad. And I was really surprised at the look of Golden Corral Cake. Completely changed their look. Check this out. Now this is a new look of Golden Corral. Completely different. Look at that. I just got a little uh, thing. I'm going to sit down and have some meat items. Well, the main items. And you, know, you had to start off with uh, with the salad. And got the silverware. I'm going to have uh, so a little bit of mashed potatoes. Yeah, really good. Got some meatloaf. I love the meatloaf. That's a 10 out of 10. The mashed potatoes about 9 out of 10. I got some little taco meat right there. That was really good. 10 out of 10. Some cream spinach. Delicious. 10 out of 10. That was really good. Uh, I got some of the buttery, cheesy uh, red potatoes. And of all the potatoes, I think red potatoes are my favorite. I like blue potatoes, but, you know, they, that's very rare that I ever get them. I only bought them, like, once. I've had some blue potato chips. Now I'll try the fried fish. Try that out. It was okay. I thought it was a little bit on the dry side. I get that maybe eight, eight out of ten. I got some of that Bourbon Street chicken. Delicious. And John's got some of John's food. He got a giant piece of baked chicken right there. Look at that. That looks fantastic, man. Wow. Oh, that's a little bit of uh, a one thing of the baked ravioli. It was okay. I got eight out of ten. There was so much there, though. I mean, you know, it just sample a little bit of each. You know. A little more. Uh, I think a little more of the Bourbon Street chicken. I think. Right there. So, I mean, everything was so good. And here's like the uh, one of the ribs right there fall off the bone pretty much. That's kind of I wish those ribs I had on the live stream would like fall off the bone. Now, this was pretty decent. At, uh, 9 out of 10. Let me try that out. John's got his stuff. He found ham and uh, cabbage and ham. Fried cabbage. I love fried cabbage. That was pretty decent. Yeah, I like that. See what else is going on. I mean, I there was so much there, you know. And so, I mean, could I always have, like, you know, there's so much there, but I only usually get about half of what they have there. It's, you know, it's like, where to start, you know. And then I forgot to try their pulled pork on the side. That was really good. That was delicious. I put, like, uh, like spicy barbecue sauce. That was a 10 out of 10, too, the barbecue pulled pork. I forgot to review that right there. Right there, staring right in front of me. I thought I got everything, but I didn't. Now here's my uh, another go around of meat items. So I got I got some of the carving stuff. I got well I got a piece of popcorn shrimp that was pretty decent. That was nine out of ten. And I got stuff from the cart. Now with uh, I got a piece of ham. I love ham. Ham is the best. And the ham was fantastic. That was a ten out of ten right there. Ham is the best. Now there's something different when I get to the steak. Cause the steak without the carving thing. Well I got some uh, Yankee pot roast. The pot roast was delicious. I think that's what Michael said he likes the most. I got some uh, 
some steak. Now the steak, now there's a microphone. You have to talk in a microphone what type of steak you want. I got uh, medium. And you see the pink in the middle. And this was really good steak. Not as good as Texas Roadhouse, but it had a good, I like that charbroiled taste flavor to it. Tried some uh, kielbasa. Uh, I didn't have any orange juice, though. <laughs> that was really fantastic. Steak was a 10 out of 10. Okra was a uh, 8 out of 10. Kielbasa was like 9.5 out of 10. And some of these, are, I mean, are better than others. Of course, I got some more meatloaf. I love the meatloaf. That's a 10 out of 10, of course. I was really happy with everything. John got John got some big pieces of steak and sauerkraut and everything like that. He got a ton of food, man. And so did I. I was so full, and I got a little bit more after all this. But, I mean, you know, we just took our time, and I got a little bit of filling up with the dessert. Here we go. Oh, man, I'm so full. Now you have a little bit more dessert. I never, this is the first time I ever used that chocolate waterfall I put, and John was teasing. He actually took a piece of, uh, he actually took one of that, little bit of that uh, strawberry with the chocolate. It was really delicious. It was, I mean, I never had anything in that chocolate waterfall before. Because usually I don't get to dessert that much. I usually full, I get full on so much other stuff, I don't get dessert. Oh, I can't eat anything else. Just have this cookie. It's way for thin, way for thin. I'm glad it didn't turn out like meaning of life. That would have been horrible. That chocolate cookie was fantastic. That was a 10 out of 10, too. Very chocolatey. Full of chocolate good. I dipped a little bit in that remaining chocolate sauce right there in a little bowl. And by this time, I was really full. I mean, and then I have uh, the fudge brownie. I dipped in a little bit of chocolate sauce right here. I dipped, and this was very rich and so, so decadent. It was deliriously good. I was so, I was so full, man. And uh, I was very happy and content, but boy, I was stuffed. Now I took, I, you know, going back, I had taken, I would slept for like about an hour and a half after eating all this. It was so good. It was really good. I mean, I was just surprised by the new look of Gon Corral. And I did a video about bubblegum machines in there. They took the bubblegum machines out. Completely redid the whole thing. And, and I know Mike Creech was talking about the lady was kicked out in Erie for brockness. And the whole meal, including Pop, came to $17.26. And I definitely got my money's worth. And the waitress was very attentive. So until next time, everybody, please take care of my legion. Yeah, baby.